Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, I'm here with episode 29 of Assassin's Creed Rogue. In the previous episode, we wrapped up everything we needed to do in the North Atlantic, at least in terms of exploration. Uh, so we finished the last two areas of the Fort Bay Rouge. So we started off at Lewisport, cleared that out, and then came over to the Sapphire and cleared that out as well. Which is also where we hand in our um, Templar relics, once we've collected all the buried treasures. And after doing so, we actually picked up all the other... Um, buried treasures that we needed to find in the North Atlantic. Uh, well, at least of what we've currently got in our inventory in terms of Templar maps. Uh, we then went back to River, River uh, the New York, and completed memory one of sequence six, which was the heist, I believe is what it's called. So we basically joined Jack Weeks to dress up as the sort of smuggler assassins in the sort of uniform and sneak into the fort and let them out and steal the treasures, just to sort of incite a war between the British and the Assassins, so that should mean it'd be a bit easy to deal with them from now on. Uh, so yeah, that's what we did. Uh, today we are going to be finishing up River Valley. Uh, all the reasons we've got left, so... I've obviously picked up all the Uncharted Collectibles and visited all the areas. So I should do a quick cut and see you guys when we've collected them. Okay, so, uh, first of all we're going to head to this fort, so I'm on the Morrigan. The outfit we're currently wearing is that of Aguilar, I believe, who was the uh, the protagonist of the Assassin's Creed movie, which we don't talk about because it was utterly dreadful. <laughs> it was a film I was excited for, uh, for as soon as it was like rumoured, like years before, and I watched it and it was just, it was, it was dreadful, so, yeah. Anyway. On a lighter note, let's take down this fort, which is the last fort in the game, obviously. And um, all the other settlement locations, so like areas of occupation, are all the assassin HQs in uh, New York, which we'll work on uh, in future collector episodes. You might notice in the Uncharted uh, collectible set, I actually. This is the second time taking down this fort because I couldn't get the Uncharted collectible that was near here uh, without taking it down. Because obviously, if you when they get the Morrigan up close, it enters combat mode, so you can't let go of the wheel. I 
and um, I try to go in about as far as the margin can go without getting to combat and swimming over, but obviously the water's too cold and uh, you froze to death before I can get there, so. But thankfully, uh, the, the defense is respawned, so I can do this with you on the screen. Trapped here. Oh my god. <laughs> Morgan's just not moving at all. Come on. There we go. We should do it. to go. Make sure everything's all calmed down now. Let's hit on Ian. Uh, I think when it comes to off screen stuff I've done as much as I can now other than maybe some extra pillaging that I need to do. Um, I've finished up all of the naval fleet missions uh, that are, were unlocked by sequence 5 so I think the rest of them won't unlock now until we've Finish the main game. Alright, come on, boys. Hey! Oh. Cheers, lads. <laughs> Should make my job a little bit easier. Where's this? Where is it? Where are we going? Ah, I see. Hey! Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, stop shooting my boys. How dare you. Let's get grieving. Just try and turn down the last commander. Bit of them calm down and start getting all in my face. I assume it's just the typical one, like two fragments and two chests. So they might both be over this way. Oh, I see the chest. Go, oh, it's up there. Never mind. You know me. This is not going to be your lucky day, pal. Turn out the loot thing. Come on. Hmm. Very interesting. 
I don't know where a lot of the fragment is, but sure. Right, come on, lad. I don't know what Shay's doing, but it works. There we go. I was going to say, do you have to go for everyone by who I actually want you to kill? Alright, not bad. That was pretty easy. And there we go. That's the last part in the game. The last part in the Assassin's Creed series, at least, of, as of the uh, present. Beautiful. For the Empire. Yay. Quite right, too. Yes, W Patrol as well. Oh, it's actually right at the front. Okay. That's probably why I didn't see it then. Alright. So, how do I get out of there? Do I have to go around a long way? Ah, okay. Let's do this way. Alright, fair enough. It's like just a, like, basically an alternate way to get into the into the fort, rather than just, you know, through the front door. But there we go. Awesome. Okay, I don't think there's anything to check out at the uh, Harbour Master, because I've actually got all the upgrades I can currently get from the Morrigan. So, that's that done. Uh, so I guess we just move around in any order, really. Uh, let's go to Arushi. Arushi, Arushi. So this should finish up all of our um, collectibles in terms of, I think, like our uh, totem poles, um, maybe our viking sword fragments, unless there's some in New York. I'm not sure. Okay. Oh, gotta go across this way, never mind. Um Okay. Oh damn, I'm glad you called out there, Shay. It'd have been bad if you didn't. I hope there's nothing else down this way. Probably would have shown up if if it did. Yeah, this, oh, this is where the last native pillar is, which would be the quest item, surely. So this actually might not be that long a location. Although that means we can pop back to, uh, is it Orenda? Where, um, the... You hand those in. I know which one I'm talking about, it's just if, uh, I've got the right name for it. Because there's two that are very similar setting names right next to each other. It's the one where we went in uh, sequence three. Okay. Where's that chest? It's up. Okay. Just go where the road leads us. Wait, no, there's no uh, animals around either. Hmm. Ah, okay. How do I? Um. Hmm. Ah, oh, so it's about right. We right, cool. Oh, oh there's a cape painting as well. Quite a bit going on in this place. Oh, come on. Oh, there's two cave paintings. Oh, this place is just it's just jam packed, isn't it? Alright, that's a little bit simpler. Okay, I shall take you. Thank you. Awkward bastard. Really? 
What are you doing? I had that trouble with the... Um, oh, the meant to go through this way. I didn't see that, did I? When I was doing the Uncharted Collectibles, that first fragment took me so long to do because he just, rather than jumping onto that tree trunk, he would... onto the, um, the, the branch. Why? Shay. He would just topple down to the floor. It, didn't, it wasn't a specific thing. It wasn't like a certain way you had to do it. You just sometimes it would do it, sometimes it would just fall to the floor. Honestly. He's nothing but a pest. See? Look. Any other person would know exactly what I wanted you to do there. But you. You are not oh my... Oh, just walk right into the fire. Literally, nobody else <laughs> ever would do some of the stupid things he does. Okay, so we've got to get up there for the chest, I assume. This way looks sensible. Which is a strong word to use when you're in the presence of Shay. Oh, this leads a whole other direction. Uh, this leads to no direction. We can't even go up any. Okay, so this is this is the right way. Oh dear. Oh dear. Hmm. Don't die. Okay. Um. How do I get back up? Oh. You sure? I need to jump up and not just slide down to the bottom like a common fool. I get the feeling that I'm missing that cave painting. Okay, I can hear the chest. I don't know where it is though. This is a whole lot of effort just for a single bleed. There's a blueprint as well? Are you kidding me? Yes, don't you dare. Ah, oh, there's the cave painting. I should hope. Where is it? You didn't miss it, have I? Six minutes in a little nook. I had no way of seeing. At least we don't have to deal with them again. That should be it for that, I think. I said miscalculated. Okay, yep, yeah, that's the one. So that's in. Uh... Oh. Okay, I thought it was. Um... And this sound. Oh no, yeah, it is this sound. Okay, yeah, no, that was, I knew where I'm going. Uh, okay, right, so that just leaves this sucker. He's down there, obviously. Ok, 
Okay, what do you have in store for me? Hmm. At least it's a cannons. There we go. That's what I'm after. Now, where's that chest? Oh, I see. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's the last chest sorted. Still don't know what the hell I'm doing with this cave painting. Oh wait, could I be that idiot? Could I be that idiotic? I could be that idiotic. Oh my word, well, that's gonna take some cutting, isn't it? <laughs> Jesus, that's atrocious. Alright, thank god we're done here. In the ass of an island. Okay, uh, we are going to briefly return over here because we are going to pick up our native armor, which I feel we bleed and earned. What stupid totems. Alright, anytime today. Anytime will do. So over this way, okay. So they were in that for the uh, the rest of the episode. No problem. Oh, ancient hero. Cool. And there we go. That actually looks. Oh, that looks pretty cool, actually. I think. All right, we are done. Now let us move on to or do not. Or do not. So we've got a plantation to deal with. And apparently we've got a few um, activities. Alright. Uh, okay, viewpoints up that way. So you can ask the plantation up there. Right. There's some type of wolf over wolf. This area, maybe it could be black wolves. That'd be nice. Oh. Three key holders. Hey. Easy peasy. Okay. Fragment up here, it would seem. Grab you. There you go. <laughs> All right. Sweet as. It's the eight post cleared. Oh no, no! Don't do that. Go the proper way, please. All right. Let's try and get that fragment. Oh, is just gonna stand there, you know. You know, like a moron. 
doing? Dude, are you kidding me? You can't be kidding me. Okay, that's a little gagging. What's in here? Gotta be something interesting. Surely. <sighs> you moron. You broke the bloody stairs. Or the bridge, whatever. Seriously nothing in this entire thing. Oh, there's a chest, wow. Bravo. I have to find another way around because you know what she is like. If the route isn't explicitly clear, you will not take it. There's no improv. Still in the outpost area apparently. I mean sure. Look, laddie. Okay, what have we got? Plenty of requests for hey. Um, right. Finish upon this end. Is it going to be useful at all, or is it just. Stop running until you know we hit something. Right. And you appear to be a very awkward one. Gotta get all the way up there. Ah, okay. Never mind, it's not actually that bad. The dude just leaves me speechless. <laughs> Honestly. Um, I've got a chest down this way. You know, some people take more conventional approaches to um, descending, but. Not our shade. No, no, no. Let's just plumb it. Okay, and that's up there from what I can see. Will this work? Oh, I certainly won't. No. Yeah, probably go higher. I don't see a way to. That goes back up that way. 
Absolutely guarantee. Oh, no, never mind, he did get it. Well, you can see why I don't have a lot of faith in him, let's be honest. He's not exactly been um, very reliable, has he? Let's get rid of Farley Cars of Ruckus. I see beavers. Okay. Um, let's see. Is everything sort of in this way now? Is that black wolf? It is a black wolf. Okay, cool. Well, at least we've got um, another animal we can contemplate pelts for. That should also finish up our obstacle chance to skin every type of animal. That'll be what the hunting challenge is for as well. Oh, great, a supply camp. And Debbie Dozy. Yep, well. Okay, that's this fragment. Templar map, no doubt it's distant for the North Atlantic, seeing as how troublesome this episode's been, just to rub salt in the wound. John started up, which will no doubt be for Black Wolves. Come on, stop it. Accept my challenge. Yes, I know what you're going to say. Black Wolves. Alright, just got the two. Give me a one. Viking sword. A good day's hunting. This just leaves the innovation. We're ready and willing to do some good work, kind sir. Yeah, good on. And finished. Thank God for that. <laughs> my word, this episode is just chaos. I've had my thing, my video desync. Obviously, the two locations I've done have took absolutely forever to do. It's just a nightmare scenario. Okay, uh, so I've got four more locations to clear up. Hopefully, we can get that done next time, not making any promises. So, 75%, uh, 49%, secondary, 79%, collectibles, 84% activities. Uh, database. Let's see. Hospitality's plea. So some of these might be from uh, naval missions. The Omani, Omani Arabs. Right, that's it for that. Key okay, paintings, we've got another two, haven't we? The La Frontiers. Son who was born first was born laughing and was called the Good Spirit. The son who was born second caused the Sky Woman so much pain that she died. He was called the Evil Spirit. 
Okay, I'm lighting in the sky. Good spirit grieved for his mother, but he took her eyes and raised them into the sky, so one could become the sun, and the other, the moon. Her tears became the stars. This way, the world would no longer be in darkness. How lovely. Uh, Anna's fragments, they would be to another one of these, didn't we? Return to me here when you can, Cypher. Sure. Uh, okay, so does it for them? Shanties, don't think we picked anything new either, did we? No. Uh, people. Most of the rest of these, I don't think we'll have actually changed. It's best just to double check. No. Okay, so, yeah, that's where we're going to end it for today, that catastrophic episode. Uh, in the next episode, we will make our way through the remaining locations. So we'll go, well, try our best to. So we've got Labras du Signia, if that's even as that. Rivière, Orif, Orifère. Uh, Cua de Liva. And... Vieli Carrieri, and if we can have enough time left after that, we'll start up memory two of Secret Six. So, yeah, that's where we're going to end it for today. Uh, before we wrap up, let me thank my amazing patrons. My five Pompous patrons are Ron Highland, Ever the Snake. You can find links to their channels as well as my other three Pompous patrons in the description down below. And on screen, you'll see credit to my one Pompous patrons. Thank you so much, everyone. It's truly appreciated, and it goes a long way into the channel. So, I do thank you a lot for that. And if you should join those patrons, you can follow the link in the description down below to my Patreon page. But you don't have to do that because at the end of the day, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And also be sure to share the video. I'll see you guys in episode 30. Bye, guys.